Hello, my name's Bob Willis, and every month we show you how to do it. Whenever you've got a failure in manufacture, whether it's a printed circuit board or a component, or even a solder joint on a printed circuit board, the important thing is getting all of the information which allows you then to assess the root cause of the problem. And this is also true when you're asking a laboratory, a supplier, uh, to look at a problem for you. You must give them all the information. So you must know what all the information is. So if we take an example, if you've got a failure of a printed circuit board and it's a solder joint failure, then you should know how that solder joint was produced. Now, if you're using a contract manufacturer, you should know every material, every process, and every process parameter used to produce that product. Now, if you're subbing product out, then you should have gathered that information during your uh, new product introduction phase of the process development. That allows you to gather the information, make sure the information is readily available within your company. It gives you a check sheet to make sure the process doesn't change over time. Now, if all that information is available with the failures and the information is exactly that was used on the process problem that you're investigating, then a laboratory or an external service will be able to assist you. If you just have the product failure, then they may well be able to assist you, but it just makes it a lot easier if you have all the information to hand when evaluating a particular failure.